Let's be burning the incense, man. Can you smell it? Oh, so good. Hi, everybody, and welcome back to my channel. Yes, I do more than just burn candles. I also burn incense, and I just recently ordered from my favorite incense company called Wildberry. They've been around for a very long time, since my kids were in high school. That's kind of when I found them. My kids actually turned me on to them way back. Well, it must have been how many years ago? Let's see. My daughter's 24, so I would say about six, between 10 and six years ago. So anyway, um, I found them in a little shop here in Wisconsin, and then um, I decided, you know what, I'm just going to order online because it comes straight from the company. They are a company based out of Ohio, and I am absolutely in love. So um, they also have a scent of the month, which July's scent of the month was Fizzy Pop. And if you guys have never smelled Fizzy Pop, it's like, it's like champagne mixed with 7-Up, mixed with fizzy, bubbly goodness. It is amazing. Um, you don't get that real, like, smoky smell with this incense. I mean, obviously, there is smoke, but it's more of just a beautiful aroma, and it goes throughout the whole entire house. So you only need one stick, and literally, you get scent throughout the whole entire house. And the scents that they have are literally I keep on saying literally, but literally unbelievable. So let's get started. Okay, so they came in this box here. This is what it looks like. And let me open it up here. Um, When I opened it up and I didn't open up my package per se yet, what was inside, um, I saw that there was a little note on top of my incense and it reads, warning. This package may have free incense. You may find extra sticks in your order. These are seconds that didn't live up to our quality standards and we're giving them to you for free. So I thought that that was really cool and everything is just like wrapped really nicely in this paper. So I am opening it up for the very first time with y'all. And my phone's going off. Oh my goodness. Okay, here we go unwrap and um okay here is my little order form here um i ordered let's see 15 sticks come per pack i think you can order 15 25 or 100 and i just got the 15 uh stick packs and they are three dollars so i mean that's a lot of sticks for a cheap a cheap price i got cotton candy vanilla cherry Pumpkin Spice, Raspberry Rose, Root Beer, Tranquility and Sunshine, and then the, like I said, the scent of the month was Fizzy Pops, so I believe you get five Fizzy Pops uh, for free. So this one here is Root Beer, and this is how they come. They individually wrap every single one, and there it says right there, Root Beer. And what I like about these two is every single different scent has a different design on the top. So some of these you will see will be, you know, blue, some of them red. It just all depends on what scent. Okay. Oh my God. It literally smells like root. I don't know what I was expecting. It smells like creamy root beer soda. This is unbelievable, you guys. Okay, so this is what their stick looks like here. Oh, I am definitely burning this today. Oh my God. It's seriously unbelievable. I cannot believe that they can, well, I mean, I guess I can. They can get it in candle form. Why can't they get it in incense form? So I'm going to show you guys what I use also to burn the incense. Um, I use this glass bottle that I bought at my local Vagabond store and um, it comes with this little like topper here. And basically what you do is you put the incense stick in here like so, get it to stick. And then it kind of hangs off like this. Okay, so just like that. And then you take your glass container and you put your incense stick in 
and it balances. And then um, also what happens, there's little holes on the bottom of the glass container and that is where your scent comes out. And then it also sometimes comes out on the top, but it is magnificent and I cannot wait to burn that one. So kudos to you guys, Wildberry. I will also leave um, all of their information down below for you guys to order. Oh, I can't stop smelling it. Okay. So this next one here, oh, these are my fizzy pops. This is literally the best smelling scented incense stick you will ever get your hands on. I kid you not. Um, there it says, fizzy pop, fizzy, fizzy, fizzy pop. And these are kind of like an iridescent blue uh, with glitter attached to it. I should have ordered more of these. Oh my freaking God. Oh my God. Amazing. You can smell the effervescence in there and it's just, it's to die for. You get a little bit of lemon, you get a little bit of lime. Um, like I said, you get like that kind of champagne-y scent also mixed in and it's just simply amazing. Um, let's see. Okay. Now some of these I have not smelled before just because they are new scents. I believe this one, the pumpkin spice is definitely new. So this is kind of exciting for me because I've never really had like a fall themed incense. Uh, so this will be fun to see what this smells like. Let's see. Ooh, ooh. This one smells really good. Um, let me let me take it out of the package. Let me take a few out here. Oh yes. It is like a sweet cinnamon pumpkin, but more pumpkin, less cinnamon. Oh, it almost smells like candied pumpkin is what it smells like. That's really good. That's going to be a good one to burn um, in the fall. Basically, what I usually do with my incense if I'm not burning candles that day is I will light one incense stick in the morning and then I will light one incense stick at night before I go to bed. And I will literally have scent throughout my whole entire home with just burning it in one bedroom or one room of the house for 24 hours, sometimes longer too. Oh, my phone's ringing. When mother calls, you answer the phone. Okay, so this next one is Raspberry Rose. I do not remember this scent at all, ever. And they used to have a very nice ras or a very nice rose scent that I would get, um, but never Raspberry Rose. So this will be interesting to see what this one smells like as well. Oh my gosh, that is beautiful. Love it. Let me take some of these out here to just snip away. Oh, oh, this smells so good. And if you guys can see too, the tip of these are color coded here. Oh, that smells so beautiful. You know, if you guys have always been interested in incense, but you were too scared to get it just because of like, you know, all the smoke and um, what I want to say, just you know, you were scared about it just because maybe the scents were too strong or you just, you really weren't educated on it. This is definitely the company to start with. Um, this is the company that I started with and I stayed with. Like I did, you know, venture out a little bit uh, back in the day and I didn't like any of the other incense that they had. It was this company. Okay, the next one is Cherry Vanilla, one of my all-time favorite scents from this company. Um, highly remember this one. Oh, this is like going back in time. Oh my God. First of all, I'm like a sucker for anything cherry. I love cherry scents. I love cherry scents with candles, anything cherry, you know, body care. Love this one. Beautiful um, mixture of cherry and vanilla together. Gorgeous. What do I all have in here? Let's see. Okay, then this next one, ooh, is my candy cane. Thought this one would be really good for kind of like a minty, you know, type of scent throughout the home. Oh, that peppermint. It's like candied peppermint. Or it's like those little candy um, red and white mints that you would get to suck on. Oh, so good. 
I am so happy that I placed an order with this company, you guys. Okay, and the next one that I have here is Tranquility. Now, I cannot remember if this one is an old scent or a new scent, but let's smell it together. Oh, this is really nice. I definitely get like a spa kind of, not real beachy, more of a spa ocean scent. Like crystal blue water mixed with spa. Oh, that smells like heaven. I love this one as well. And then there's one more package in here. What does this one say? So, oh, sunshine. This is my sunshine. Now, I don't also remember if this is a new one or not. Um, but let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, no. This is an older one as well. I definitely remember this one, too. It just smells very clean and bright and cheery. A little bit of sunflower action going on here as well. And a little bit of orange, um, maybe mandarin as well. Really, really nice scent. Okay, so that is everything that was in my incense container. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to comment down below if you have any questions about Wildberry. Thank you guys so much for watching and happy day. Bye, everyone.